Hello everyone and welcome to episode 42 of Circaz Plays Minecraft. And um, I was actually not going to bring you in yet. Um, but look what I found. I was moving my... Uh, there's two over there. <laughs> I was moving my, uh, my nether rack downstairs because I really... My way. Oh, damn. Oof, getting frame rate issues. Probably because of all the entities. Oopsies, come on. Kill the guy. Did I kill him? Yeah, there's so many entities right here. Oh, I got it. Another one. Holy, look at that. Without wanting, I think I'm building a. Uh, whatever these things are called. Uh, I forgot their names. Anyway, um, I'm going to get back to work. I just wanted to get that on camera. Uh, I don't have the ability to collect, but it doesn't really matter. Again, let me bring this back down. I'm just putting my stuff away, the nether rack, because it's just annoying me up there and I just put these chests down here uh, moving everything down here and uh, I'm gonna continue building the collecting chamber I'm not sure yet how I'm going to do uh, but I started working on it so I'm pretty sure I'll figure something out um, got the glass all the way up um, so now it's just a matter of figuring out uh, how I'm gonna terminate it up there and what's gonna be the um, where the redstone is going to come from for the clock or the crusher and all that good stuff. Um, I'm having like gigantic frame rate issues here. I'm sorry for that. Um, but it should uh, give you an idea of what's going on here. And I really just want to get you in uh, for the capture. Did that just despawn? I think it did. Wow. Anywho, um, that's what's that. And, uh, as soon as I have something else, I'll bring you guys back. Maybe I'll get more of these guys. Let's just speak. Oops. Again, I never got into studying um, where they spawn or don't spawn, but I didn't think they would spawn up here, though. But, oh well. That's fine with me. I mean, I'm not sure I'm going to want that. I'm not sure if lighting levels can affect um, their spawn. Anyway, be right back. All right, guys, welcome back. Um, yeah, I did quite a bit of changes here. Uh, wasn't happy with the possibility of building the the killing chamber up here for a simple reason. I didn't have enough room for any redstone or anything that wouldn't be just ugly and whatever and so what i'm thinking of doing is to bring it you know i might keep it like this i might actually put glass up here i'm not sure yet maybe not actually uh, but this way you can look all the way down it's kind of cool and stuff um now i'm experimenting with this down here so please don't judge yet i'm not sure about this yet because hmm, i might add a oh, row we're just really tight here i don't want to go that close and so this might have to be the max we go this way I might add a bro on this side though because hmm. we got plenty of room uh, I just don't know how it will look if it's not even um, I don't I'm not really not sure about this sandstone I, I was just playing with it I'm gonna put it as it was before which was just nether brick um, I'm feeling good about this project, actually. Uh, it's, I think it's looking good. Uh, and I love functionality, I really do. But if it doesn't look good, I won't feel right. You know what I mean? It's like 
that's a, I'm the same way professionally. Like when I'm working on something, you know, sometimes I tend to procrastinate because I'm not happy with it. I don't know what it is. I can't figure out. I can't put my finger on it. I can't figure out what the next step is to make something better. Um, that's perfectionist, man. It sucks. <laughs> uh, I don't wish it on anybody, but yeah, that's just kind of the the reality. Oh, um, I did go to the overworld and got tons of sandstone. My pick, I, this is all from getting sand. And I left tons of sandstone back and I made it into smooth sandstone here. I needed these stairs. Too bad we don't have smooth sandstone stairs. I might tweet a dinner bone because he was talking about half slabs. Sorry. Smooth sandstone slabs. That's what I want. Well, stairs would actually be good too. Um, but they're going to make nether brick half slabs. so Or slabs, I should say. So, you know, why not? just you know he said <laughs> um i'm rambling now but he said dinnerbone said that he um if he added some slabs he'd have to add more than just one type so all right now here the advantage of doing it this level is that i don't plan on coming to the bottom level much um and i'm thinking of having like a um like a fake floor so this would actually be mm, let's see I don't know how you know I don't want to be enough for me to walk in but uh, might have one air level and then another level below it just to have um, just for redstone and stuff now I wonder if I should do um, sandstone half slabs Oh, dang it. I'm not going to be able to figure this out. Because. Actually, I might. Let's see. Let's check this out. Let's go over here. Okay. So I might do this. I really don't like the sandstone bottom, though. Mm. Okay. The reason for this would be to have all the cable, the redstone cable needed. And any, uh, you know, trap doors and not trap doors, but um, pistons and stuff like that at that level. And so this would be the entire. Might still do it. I might still do it. And then we can just close it off. Like the edges could be like this. Oops. One too many. You know what I mean? I don't know what you guys think. But I think this could work. Might need more sandstone though. And so this would go all around it. Oops. Uh, yeah, I got my other diamond pick because my first one that I had was dying. And this thing is amazing. I need 37 levels to fix, enchant this one along with my unbreaking three in fortune 2 and it gives me fortune 3 efficiency 4 and then breaking 3 which is a darn good and it takes 37 levels um oh man oh these break the entire thing now don't they yep all right but this is kind of what i'm thinking um and so not just around this would be filled completely in here and so in the middle i wouldn't put anything and I could run redstone and all that stuff. I think it could work. It could work. I really do. Doesn't look too bad. It looks like a funky trim. The other thing that I wanted um, was to put these fences, nether brick fences, all around. If I go, the problem is they're not they're not easy to come across. Actually, let me try something here. Give me that. Two will do. I think. I don't like the way this is looking right now. And so I could do much better, I think. What do you think? Maybe one over here. Kind of looks good, doesn't it? I don't know. Um, I'm going to put another one here all the way down. I don't know. I don't want it to be too crowded. But the, the idea would be... Actually, I'm... One, two. One, 
too. Hmm. Yeah, this is where it gets tricky in terms of uh, size. But this isn't bad. Like, I could kill him here, the blazes. Because the idea... I still have to figure out the killing chamber. I'm not sure yet. But... Um, ideally, I won't have blocks at this level. Except on one of the sizes, sides. Or... Ah, dang it. No, 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 no. I could close... I could have a piston at that level, which means that's one, two, down, and then, let me think, guys, I'll get there, give me just a sec, no, see, I'll have to have the piston, the one that locks them in, one, two, if I had them here, no, ideally, I'll have the piston at this level. Because then the blazes sit on it, and then one, two, and could have a piston here that pushes down, it suffocates them, then it goes back up, and they're right here. But I want it I want to be at their feet, don't I? So the piston needs to be actually on that thing, there, right there. What do I do with the lava? It needs to come from somewhere else. Because I need them to swim all the way here. And then I need to close. One, two. Powering that piston is going to be fun. Technically, I could have the piston there. I could have a block, solid block. Next to it. I could put. I could power it diagonally, I think. I have to look into that. Maybe this is the thing. It won't be. I won't. I want to have it pretty. <laughs> pretty. No, I want to have a good looking. Um, but it's kind of limiting because of the size that the redstone takes. Um, so if I had a piston up there, which is fine, that pushes down, that would stop the lava. So the lava would have to be here the uh, source of the lava would have to be here so when the piston is up the lava goes down when the piston goes down the lava is gone and this is the only block they could occupy and this block is closed which means it suffocate for a few seconds I have to figure out where I'm gonna put the clock the clock could come from the bottom somewhere I think yeah I might have to Might have to find out. This might not be able to be glass. My, and if I want to hide the redstone, this is going to take way more work. I might have to have like the fake floor. I don't need a flake, the fake floor down here, because honestly, that that's the only one that I need is to drop that a few. How many blocks? Right now, it's there. One, two, three, four. Four would let it come through here into here and I could sink it with the stair so it's not even noticeable and then what can I do go back up into there I'll just drive it somewhere here put a lever like here or something I don't know I'm gonna play with this a little bit off camera obviously just because it's gonna take a while um, and then I'll bring you guys back as soon as I have something in the show for. Um, I am happy, like I said, I am happy with how this is starting to look, but I'm afraid I'm going to have to kill the mood a little bit. Oh, man. I'm going to have to change something here. Maybe not. This is like one and then one, two and then one. Because I used to have this one more over this way. Gah. Which I might be able to do still now but I did want to have yeah this needs to go this needs to be nether brick this needs to be nether brick sorry 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 ah but then that touches oh man this is such a weird spot um Oops.
Wait, wait, wait. That's not right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Which one is right? Okay, that comes one down above the pistons. That one is wrong. Is that what Pete was saying the other day? Might have been. Oops. Sorry. <laughs> okay. So that needs to go there. Right? Yeah. And then this goes here and there. Boom. There we go. Much, much better. Aw, oh, dude. How did I miss that? I thought I fixed it, Pete. Sorry about that. Pete did put in the comments that I had that off, but Peteman1000. Thank you very much. Anyway, um, be right back. Try to play with this a little bit. I have to, still have to think about if I'm going to do a roof on this or a roof, like some people say, which makes no sense because rough is what the dogs, you know, sound like. <laughs> it's a roof, people. Roof. It's double O. Um... But then again, I don't want a roof in here. It's just going to look a little bit weird. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. So I have to do some stairs down. Man, so much to do. This is going to end this episode, though. You will see the finalized product by the end of this episode, which is awesome. All right, guys. See you in a bit. Bye. All right, folks. I think we're ready to give it a try. Um... The design is not finished yet. This is completely like manual. Um, but um, this will be glass. That will be glass. Lava can flow. Not terribly happy about this design, but this is the only way that I found uh, to keep it on a three wide. This might be glass eventually. I don't know if they glitch through glass. That's covered, so I need to uncover that. So now, okay, love is going all the way down. The crusher is right here. It will work. So the, okay, here goes nothing, guys. I don't know if I'm going to get pounded by. I do want to know if I get, I can spawn them from here. Let's see. We'll start hearing. Okay. Now the question is, am I going to get pelted from here? And are they going to go above? Okay, they sure are up there. Far, so good. Okay, this should be enough. Let's turn it off. I don't want it to be overflowing. They try to shoot. I don't know if Are there still any? No. Okay, so first are they all up here too? That's good. They're all up here. I need to turn off lava. Now, I don't know how many ticks, well, how many hearts they have. I think this is you know, two, three, four, five. Uh, I can't really count. Okay, they're not. Uh, why did not I get any blaze rods? Are they falling through there? Oh, this is not good. It worked, but now the question is. I might just have to make it a bigger design. That's just the reality of it. 
Get out of my way. Did they fall back here or something? Okay, where are the blaze rods? This one I had already, so... Mm, not happy about this. What the heck happened? Dang it. This was so close to working, guys. Oops. Let's get that thing. Okay, the overall design is working. Now the question is, well, it's working, but it's not, right? Okay, the lava didn't burn because the lava is... F is this still down? Oops, no. <laughs> okay, let's get the lava down. <coughs> Okay, the design itself works. They stay up here. They can't fire at me. Can't wait for nether brick half slabs. Um, I, I managed to lock them here. They not drop if I don't... Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Might be able to actually spawn them from just standing here. It's here. I want to see if they come from both sides. One from that side. Dang it. Sorry if I'm too quiet. I'm trying to figure this out and I... Okay, it's coming. Who's dying? Who's dying? Okay. One more. Yep, that one's dying. Do they not drop? Seriously, I think that's the issue. Ugh, the sounds. The sounds. Okay. Close that. Come on. Turn it off. What the heck? Oh, okay. Alright. Step by step. Close the bottom. They're still coming. I gotta open. Come on up. Oops. So laggy. Oh, cool. They can't hit me. Wow. There's still a lot coming. Oh. That's too close. I'm so quiet. I'm trying to figure this out. Sorry, guys. Why is that? Okay, it's coming up. That should be the last one. Once you're up here, buddy. Or buddy, I think there's one too. Cool. Close that. Close the lava. I'm good. Yep. Okay. This works, guys. Gotta get some extra glass. Gotta automate this. Gotta check how many ticks I have to... Um, I think I'm gonna leave this open. I don't know how it looks from upstairs. Let's go up here. There's something here, don't worry guys. <laughs> the pistons glitch all the time. There's a piston right here. Actually, it doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look half bad at all. There's nothing to look for here, so that's why I'm not sure I'll keep it, but not 
can't really open, can I? Maybe I can. Technically, yeah, but I can see the that up there. Ooh, 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 no, 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 no. There's lava in there. Yeah, I can't open this. I could technically keep these two. <sighs> Sorry, I'll put you back. Put you right back. <clears throat> uh, dang it. Okay, there you go. Mm, not so sure about this. I might get rid of this glass. Let's see. Block, block, block. Block, block, block. Especially because of all that stuff. Um, still have to figure out I'm going to power this. Can I power this block? I think I can. Oh man, this, this would be perfect. Because that runs up. Mm, it's going to connect. Unless I put a block here. Then it won't. Okay, that's being powered by... No. This is being powered... <laughs> Redstone action. Uh-uh. Oh, oh. oh, I knew it. I knew it! Um... Okay. Can destroy these. How is this getting powered? Okay, so this is powering. It's from there, isn't it? It's from there. So, does it have to be a half slap to break the. Sorry, I was awake. <laughs> I walked away from the mic. Kind of. Uh, oops. I broke that. Yep, yeah, now the power is going one way. Okay, let's just get chiseled smooth. I think I think. Yeah, it still gives me this. Inventory crazy niche. Um. Why are you connecting? Oh, so this doesn't connect, huh? I could put... Oh, I didn't know that. That's good to know, actually. See, you can put half slabs and it doesn't break the redstone. Forgot about that. But this is bothering me. Because now it's not powering that. Okay, we can fix that. We can fix that with a redstone repeater. There we go. Now if I put that here. There we go. Did I open it? Yeah. Now, if I put this here, that should close it, right? There we go. So, I can. So, the goal that I've been trying to go for is to keep everything redstone behind, like under here. So, I can technically go boom, boom, boom. Oh, I'm going to be able to do that. Okay, and do it kind of uh, this. Oops. See? And keep all the redstone behind that. Actually, not this. Like that. And then here, it will. How do I have it here? One, two. Out of where? Behind there. So I'll have this. 
It won't look as good on this side, I don't think. That doesn't look half bad, does it? Again, I run into the same problem. I wish I could have this come out one more. You know what? Screw it. This is what I'll do. Come on, give me that. And this episode's going long. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I just really want to finish this, and I want to do it on camera. It's kind of dark down here. I'm not too happy about that. Uh, let's see what I can do up here to fix this. Give me these. Took, 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 took. Mm. That's okay. I can do sandstone here. Put that down. There. There, 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 there. Oh, no, no, no. I want to keep that. Now give me these. This looks kind of funky. Hmm. I might just remove the glass from up here. But I kind of like it from down there. It gives you, you know... A little bit sense of a little bit more of a size. You can see the ceiling. I don't know. Yeah, and this will be gone. There'll be one, two here. And then all the redstone will be behind here. Um, and then we'll have... Crap. I wanted to put buttons. Mm. Yeah, that won't work. So what I might have to do... It doesn't have to. I'll put levers. See, I'll put a lever here. And this lever will... I'll put a lever here. And it stops or here. <laughs> uh, I think I can put a lever here. And then a redstone torch powering a block behind this one to do something up here. And then put one here that powers the block behind it. I don't know. I want one to power on the same side. I want one to power. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. One needs to one lever closes that another lever gets this going. The closes the lava. And then a button, a button does the rest. Or maybe I'll put the levers here and the button there. I don't know. I'll figure something out. Guys, this is, uh, I might have to wrap it here. Um, you know what? Let's go a little bit extra long. Let me just finish doing this and I'll come back to you guys to just close it up. All right, be right back. All right, guys, welcome back. It's been uh, so just about 18 hours since I uh, I recorded the last, the previous segment. The reason for that is that it took me all probably six, seven hours um, to do what I'm going to show you real quick. And you can kind of see it there. It's not what I wanted ideally, but um, I wanted to hide everything. It's not possible. It's simply not possible. Redstone takes too much space. Um, I, I got a bit of an inspiration from, um, some of the work from Etho and stuff, but it's, this is all original. I mean, I didn't, um, I didn't use his design exactly. It, the principles are the same because of the, using the RS nor latch for the timer, but the, other than that, so <clears throat> let's uh, explain this real quick to wrap it up. And then maybe next time I'll do a little bit more of a detailed tour, but basically this turns, um, the lava off and it locks the um, place down there so the blazes get stuck in here and yes they fire they try to fire but they can't hit me only if i get too close they actually touch me and damage but uh, i can be all around here and it doesn't really affect me so that's cool so put that back up um that will be eventually brought here i think or there i don't know which is that what is uh for those of you who haven't seen previous episodes this is what turns on the spawning 
or stops the lava, I should say. Anyway, so I have this comes in here um, and it powers this double extender piston, um, which basically the lava is right behind this block here. Well, let's see, in front of this block here. Um, then the rest of the problem was for this, actually, because everything that I was doing was interfering with these pistons in some way. Uh, actually, that powers these extended pistons and it powers the piston that closes the the so that the the blazes don't go back down um it all does on the same thing now this <laughs> seriously guys i spent uh, yeah a good six hours on this um i tore up different designs that i was playing with <clears throat> i think i can break this one yeah so basically what happens here here is um when i when i click this uh, it powers this, comes down here, it does this whole, let's go this way, instead goes down there, goes down there, goes here, you know, downwards redstone is crappy as heck. I might lower this one block, I don't know, this is not going to work really well, I, ha I think I have to keep these open, uh, technically I might be able to put blocks here on top, it's going to look weird anyway. Um, I'm going to try to figure out ways to conceal this, but I'm not sure if that's going to be all possible. So I'm just not too worried about it. Um, and so the power comes down here this way and it powers this RS nor latch, which basically what it is, is uh, as soon as the power hits here, it powers it and it stays on, which inverts this signal, which is right now is on. So it becomes off um, and it just inverts back and on and all the time. <coughs> Excuse me. Just basically. Uh, inverts whatever is up here, which right now is on, uh, and it stays inverted until it gets reset by this pulse, which hits this block. And uh, I have this set to, I think I have 22 repeaters. I know that Etho had 23, but Etho, I, I, I do have to add one more, but I can't put it this, this one at four. Let's put the last one not at four. Um, oh no, no, this one still needs to be here. Sorry. Go back there. Okay. So, um, this is the, the seconds of the crusher. So it needs to, to put the blazes down to, um, half a heart or whatever it is that it's, um, a punch kill. Um, but basically when the signal comes back, cause this signal will power. And then as soon as this comes back, it resets and it sends it back to this default state, which is on here. Powers this door. It inverts that torch. That torch goes up. Brought this stuff down here. I don't know if I showed that on the previous segment. It's been so long that I really lost track. Um, which then goes up there, which then goes up there. Is there any quick way? No, let's just use this. Um, let's see here. Uh, comes here. And then goes... No, no, no. That's not it, though. Okay, it comes this way. Yep, that's right. That's not that one. Comes, this is the power up. That torch is inverted down there, which is a block inverts that torch, inverts this torch, which whatever, right now this should be off. <clears throat> but it powers this block, which comes here, which powers this block. <laughs> this is a big mess. Which uh, this block powers that block. Don't ask me, man. Oh, through here. That's right. I have a torch here. Oh, dang it. Um, there's a lot of... Uh, See, I'm not a, a, a redstone expert, and I don't have that much experience using it, but, you know, I do computer, so computer stuff, programming and stuff, so this is kind of fun for me, but it's all trial and error. There's no, it's not a programming language that you can just follow the the manual and kind of figure out which, which function is what, but anyway, then inverts this torch, which then powers this block, and the reason this is here, so this doesn't interfere with that, uh, which then powers, inverts this block. Oh, I can't get up there, can I? Um, let's see, which and brings that up here. And then the problem was that you have to power to power a block. You have to go straight. So you can't, uh, redstone needs to have two, two, uh, blocks wide for it to, to be directional. Um, for example, let's see if I can show you here. Let me get some redstone in hand. But if you have a block here and you do this, it's not going to power that block. So you actually, to power that block, you have to go around and have a direction on the redstone to actually, and then if this power is powered, it powers this. 
But that that proved very tricky back there because we just don't have enough space. So one solution that I found was to have the sequence of repeaters um, so that because if I didn't have these repeaters, it, it would start in affecting diagonally that that piston right there. And so the solution that I found was to power up. Um, basically, this this is considered up. It won't power a block, won't power another block diagonally. Redstone will, but not a repeater. So I had to power this way, which then here is a block which has a torch behind it, which then powers the block behind the piston, which powers this. So it's it's a uh, it's a bit convoluted, but it was the only way to keep it as compact and clean as possible. Honestly, I had. A huge thing down there trying to figure this out I mean this is I think honestly I'm kind of proud of this actually it's decently clean for Minecraft redstone um, it's just it take Minecraft redstone takes a lot of space and especially what I wanted to do here which is um, okay let's let's get this working I haven't tested with that extra repeater that I added down there so I'm curious about that too and if I'm not I'd still get suffocation over there uh, I don't know what to do about that. Uh, the good thing is, even though you can see redstone here, and I, there, I, there's no way to fix that, I try to move it over. Um, it's not easy because then the power up system will just get all affected. Um, but um, even though you can kind of see that, you still get a perspective from this glass of blazes coming in from that direction and this direction, which is what I wanted. Uh, I really don't care. Oh, yeah. That section over there, I can always come here and check. Um, but it's not as important. Yeah, see, that's my problem right now. And for some reason, it might have to do with directions. Because it might be a redstone bug simply. Because it doesn't happen on this side nearly as many times as it happens on this side. So, And again, this episode is getting extremely long. I apologize, but I think you guys will be happy to see this complete and um this actually means that i'll put the world uh, available for download on this episode i've been promising that but i wanted to get this project done before that um i'm not sure if i'll do it before or after i have this you know fixed up and stuff because i still don't know what i want to do a part of me doesn't want to put a roof on this um i'm afraid of gas spawning here though uh or or other lovely people where are you suffocating? Dang it. Oh, now it's going to be too suffocating. That's the other problem. When one starts suffocating, it breaks, breaks the circuit. Okay. So, yeah, this is not far, far, far from perfect. Um, but then again, this is Minecraft. <laughs> so, there's, there's... I don't think there's an actual way to get this perfectly working. So, um... Let's see here. I want to see them spawn. And I still ha left this uh, lookout here. <laughs> uh, gotta remove this chest. Curious why is it slowing down the spawning? Maybe this is normal. Well, if I remember from the um, from the skeletons, I did uh, time it, and it was like 30 seconds or 20 seconds between. Um, Oh, there's a bunch here. Oh, come on. Stop suffocating, man. Ugh, this annoys me. Because we lose. The system gets stuck. Okay, how many do we have here? Let's check F3 real quick. My frame rate is tanking, as always. Okay, about 16. You know what? Let's uh, shut it off. Because it takes a little bit of you know time to... Uh, I need to fix this desperately. <laughs> oh, there we go. The hitbox is not right. So, see? The hitbox is in the middle. Um, I think they'll stop spawning now. Yeah, it's enough. Light. There's still some coming down. And again, I apologize for the ep this episode being longer. Um, I think it's worth it, though. Ha! Suck it! Just kidding. Um, let's see... Let's let's um, let's let. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> uh, let's get this one up here and close it off. Are you up here? Boom! You're in. Now again. Fingers crossed. I can even hear the sounds. I love the fire coming through the piston. 
It might be too long. Maybe not. Uh, I think it's a two hit punch right now. I need to add one more tick. I don't know. This might not be a problem when I have the potions to damage them. Yeah, I don't think it'll be a problem when I have potions. So we got five levels out of 13 blazes. This is amazing. And they were all above 17, so, or most of them. Um, so yeah, that concludes this episode. I just wanted to show you this. I'm incredibly proud, like I said. Um, this is really cool. Um, happy how this turned out. It was a lot of work, guys. A lot of hours have been put into this project, but I'm really proud of it. Um, I'll finish this off down here. I'll put some staircase down. Um, I have to bring this further down and then uh, somewhere in here without affecting every other piece of redstone, uh, which is going to be real interesting to see how I do that. I might I might have to put a block here uh, with that, you know, kind of like this. This, yeah, I do. I might do something like this. I don't like it, though. But I really don't have enough room, I don't think, to bring a whole redstone wire <laughs> over here anyway i'll figure this out off camera thank you so much for watching guys again um it's been incredibly fun to uh engage people i, I do need to start doing some more self-promotion um just the amount of hours that i've been putting into this um and i love the number of subscribe the i love the, the subscribers that i have but it's uh it's kind of frustrating sometimes to just have 30 views on videos that take me like six or seven or eight or nine or ten or whatever hours this takes um so i'm i and, and it's my fault i mean i basically never advertise myself anywhere because i never like that it feels a little bit spammy but the reality is expecting people to show up on your channel to watch your videos um without you doing any promotion is kind of foolish it's not like people are going to find you out of youtube searches or something that's very unlikely and so i'm going to do a little bit of that so if um if you guys are interested follow me on twitter um because i'll put some posts to like reddit and stuff and i'll appreciate it if you guys can uh you know put a vote up or something like that um just to uh get some more viewers in and grow the community obviously and uh i'll always try to promote other people on um on crafters as well um and i apologize ivan for example that i didn't on one of the feed the beast that he shows up in the chat uh, and I never put a link to his channel just because it just I didn't even think of it. I mean, it was just chat on the ch on the on the um, feed the beast server log, you know, the chat thing. Um, but I'll try to do it a better job at that because I really want to not just grow my channel but grow the community. Um, we all win out of that. So if you like this episode, please, 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 please like it. Um, share with your friends. Put it on uh, Reddit or whatever. Um, send me a link on Twitter if you do post it on somewhere, and I'll. Uh, I'll endorse it. Um, that always works better than me posting myself everywhere. So uh, thank you so much for wa um, watching this episode. I apologize for the longer. I'm um, really happy about this. World download real soon. Um, well, actually, for you, it's right now. Just go to the <laughs> description below and you should have a world download. For me, it's a little bit more work because I want to finish this up a little bit. Um, we have been seeing some uh, wither skeletons spawn in here. And I know that there's some down there because when the world loads, you can kind of see through. There's uh, somewhere down there. So uh, I got to secure this a little bit more. But happy about it. Glad you guys uh, have been watching and enjoying. Uh, hope to see you next time, guys. See ya.